It's absolutely disgusting. It's like walking through a field of popcorn. Residents in some southern Alberta communities are dealing with an invasion of grasshoppers. In the hardest hit areas, they've been seen and heard munching their way through nearly any plant that is green, leaving only stems behind. It's horrible. They are everywhere, every size, every color, every species. It's just, it's horrible. In West Lethbridge, residents have taken to applying pesticides on their gardens after having their vegetable plants destroyed, with nearby fields having numbers of roughly 100 insects per square meter. The culprit is the two-striped grasshopper, which can eat up to one-fifth of its body weight per day. It is one of the largest grasshoppers on the Canadian prairies and has a very broad diet. The grasshoppers typically exist in smaller numbers, but in order for populations to truly explode, specific weather conditions must occur that are favorable to the survival of successive generations. It is partly in response to the hot dry weather, but it's also in response to weather sequence. So if you have a couple of years where there's enough heat and enough sun and enough high temperatures to get going, then in the third year, boom, if it's hot and dry, and that's what we have right now. Both the large numbers of grasshoppers and the hot and dry weather in which they thrive makes it hard for residents to control the insects, but keeping your yard wet can help. And while grasshoppers typically make up an important part of the food web, outbreaks of pests in excessive numbers could potentially increase into the future. We need to be prepared for this happening more often in the future, I think. And not just for this insect, some other ones are um, similar in that they benefit from hot, dry weather.